welcome you to this chocolate series and what am I going to do now? I am going to make your favorite chocolate hazelnut spread. Something that you like to have it over your bread. I like to have it over my chapati. And of course, it's a part of a lot of our chocolate desserts. So let's make this chocolate hazelnut spread. So I've got hazelnuts. They are roasted and they are peeled. So just plain hazelnuts will take in a blender jar. So in a blender jar, we have to actually grind this till it starts secreting some oil. So what do we do? We just open this, push it in once again. After grinding the hazelnuts, we need to add in oil to this and this is almond oil along with some vanilla essence. And now let's grind this further. Well, this is still not done. I need to add some more ingredients to this. So while we're doing all this, we haven't really added anything sweet. So here goes in the sugar. And let's grind this once again. So we've been grinding this for some time. And now let's add some cocoa powder. I can see that half of it is mixed and half of it hasn't. So what you should do is open this and just use a spoon. Oh wow, look at it. It's going to last me a lifetime looks like. Oh, wow. Why would I now go to the market to buy this when I can make it at home so easily? The next time I make this, I'm going to use powdered sugar because how much of a grain sugar or castor sugar you use, it is surely going to be slightly gritty. Although I enjoy it, I think I'll prefer to put powdered sugar the next time. But right now I'm going to enjoy this with my hot, hot chapatis. And how you like to have it, I'll leave it to you. But don't forget to like, share and subscribe.